The great guardian god gave us the power. Immortality. It is granted to a chosen few. It gives strength. Shows the way. But with power comes responsibility. Alien is a precious gift that must be protected from enemies. The great god disappeared, and hordes of invaders from other worlds came to take our home and our freedom. We won't let them. The people of Aelion believe in their heroes, and we will fight to the death. Rising again and again, we will turn the invaders' technologies and magic against them. And the hour will arrive when one of the immortals will become powerful enough to lead the entire planet, crush our enemies, and bring peace to Anya. Hello everyone and welcome to Skyforge. I am going to be playing this on the PS4. I have downloaded part of it to where I can start playing. I'm going to have it fully downloaded within the day. Um, but I want to make this a let's play. This is a MMORPG game. Um, I love these games but I've never quite played one besides um, Elder Scrolls Online on the PS4. Now I hear this one's a great one for the PS4 and it's very fun to play so let's go ahead and get into it and let's get started. I believe we're going to be able to create a character and all that type of stuff. I um, haven't done too much research but I hear it's a great game so let's get started here loading. It looks beautiful so far I gotta say that cutscene was great. We might have another one to cut out quiet. Let's see. Oh, we have a character creation. Okay. Uh, typically, I play as a female, but I'm going to be playing a male. Uh, I've been kind of straying away from the whole female perspective. Um, and I do plan on being a mage, so we're going to go ahead and make him look like a mage. Alrighty. He's kind of tall. I want to customize. Here we go. Body type. Height. Let's bring them down a bit. <laughs> Body type, muscular. These graphics are okay. They look kind of um, interesting style. Kind of cartoony but realistic at the same time. I like it. Uh, mass, we have muscled and portly. Oh, we want to be a bit more muscular. I want to be fat. No offense to anybody, but. Uh, okay. So back. Let's display the clothes. Yeah, that's better so we can see what we look like with some gear on. Body features. This is the face. Oh, skull size. Okay, so. Um, let's go ahead and make it about medium near the hands. Buttock size. Let's give him big butt. Big booty. <laughs> uh, okay. Then. Face hairstyle. Oh, kind of like a mohawk kind of style going. That's pretty cool there. Let's choose that one. Mustache and beard. Now here this game is like really fun, very action oriented. So I'm excited to play. Um, people are comparing it to uh, Terra, which is one of my all time favorite uh, games back when I had a PC. Uh, so I'm really excited to see what this is going to be about. Hair color here. Let's go ahead and make him with the brown hair, I guess. Face shape, skin color, eye shape. Uh, 
Okay, I'm pretty sure y'all don't want to see that. I don't care too much how the face looks, because I'm pretty sure I'm going to have a helmet on. Um, okay, so let's go to next. Mask and glasses. Look at glasses. They all look kind of odd. Huh. Interesting. Class accessory. Let's go ahead with that one. Earrings. That's pretty cool. Let's give him some some uh, multi earrings here. Tattoos. Oh, they got face tattoos. <laughs> Wait, what was that one? No, not that one. That one's pretty cool. Teardrop. Oh my gosh. In prison or what? Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and get through this because I don't want to take up too much of this first video of character creation. I'm going to give him a heavy run or a light run. Oh, that's feminine. No, uh, let's call it a heavy run. The stance. Uh, aggressive, normal, relaxed. Let's give him a normal stance. <laughs> That's on. Okay. <clears throat> Prologue. Got a nice little video coming up. All right, listen up. We're heading for Iron Our mission is to clear the town of enemies and evacuate the civilians. Keep your eyes open and be careful. Oh, yeah, You're not a Questions? All right then. I like the graphics. They're pretty good. Uh, this is free to play, by the way. Uh, okay, talk to the sergeant. What else we got here going on? Little rat thing with a staff. Can't really talk with these guys. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. <laughs> oh, this is exciting. Okay, let's go. We're gonna go talk to the sergeant over here. This is Eonor. We received a distress call. The town is being attacked by birds. The town's residents are in hiding. We need to find and evacuate them. Did he say birds? That's not very menacing. Oh, wow. Look at that. Um, so since this is the first level, I believe this is an instance kind of a MMO, so the levels are going to be all kind of instance together, not very, they're going to be explorable, but not like too big, I don't think. Oh, basic attack, attack the enemy, aim at them and press square, okay. So not long range, oh. Cool. Oh, this is going to be cool. It's action oriented, so it's kind of um, almost button matching. Hack and slash. What are those items? Probably not yet. Triangle. To fight large numbers, press triangle. Okay. Oh, wow. That was cool. Got a little cooldown on it. What's this way? A bird. Okay, not a bird. A bird. The V. All right, let's go down this way. Getting some health back there. Okay, so we get some regen. It looks like. Back off! Somebody help me! Help I am. Thank, <laughs> thank, thank you. I thought they'd tear me apart. You're welcome, kind citizen. <laughs> oh, he was saying somewhere. The town is clear. Go to the barn. Okay. That came through the controller, so I had to kind of lift it up a bit. Sorry about that. But that. Wait, that's not part of the town? <laughs> Oh, I guess not. He said to the bar. What is this guy carrying? 
Magneto. Uh, to make a dash, press L3. Oh, okay. So it's kind of some dodge and stuff going here. Not enough resource. Okay, so we have resource. Oh, that is pretty cool. And I got the dude all the way over there. You're our saviors. We're saved. Thank you. Thank you so much. We thought it was the end of us. Oh, who is that? Okay, this is pretty cool. Come, come on, on, come on. You won't take me alive. <laughs> I like this. This is uh kind of cute and funny. But serious at the same time. Oh, that was cool. Oh, they're doing a whole 300 thing. Oh, that's our SS. Oh, shit. So apparently on this game, you can play all the classes. You have to unlock them, of course, or you can buy them, um, which is typical with any free-to-play game. <clears throat> but you can unlock all the classes and switch in between playing. We got a trophy there, Immortal. I don't think that shows up on the video. So I guess we've been chosen, according to the beginning video. I didn't even like uh, take time on it. <laughs> oh man, our crew. Yeah, let's go kick some ass. They killed our friends. Desolate ruins. Okay, we're gonna find our way out to ruins. Let's see. Okay, that's the waypoint over there. Uh, but yeah, apparently as you go, you can unlock all the classes and just keep switching in between uh, playing, which is pretty cool because I like options when I play. So that's what uh, my goal is. Can I pick that up? How do I pick that up? Oh, wait, what did I just do? Okay. Is that an item? what that is um, but yeah I like options so that's why I hope this will be a long uh, let's play or series at least uh, let's play series so that way we can try out all the classes explore the land explore the game I think it's a pretty new game uh, well not pretty new but as far as MMOs go it came out in 2015 so it's uh, fairly new um, 
because those games last forever in that video here. It seems we have guests. That's a different guy. I don't remember, I think they stabbed me and threw me on the pile of the other corpses. Birds thought you were dead. Couldn't they smell you? And you don't have a scratch on you. You must be immortal. You were born under a lucky star. Come on, it's my duty to bring you to Alien on now. Uh oh, looks like we get to the, the cool part. Finish. Okay. This is pretty neat. I like the the whole Asgardian tech feel. This is pretty cool. I wonder if that's the city right there. Look at that. The capital in all its beauty. Nothing else like it. Yep, we're lucky. Not every day you meet an immortal. Immortal? Really? <laughs> Why don't you find us? Have, Have some respect. respect. Okay, prep for arrival. Almost there. Neat. This is a very um, immersive uh, experience so far, like the videos. You don't get this typically on uh, free-to-play MMO games. Uh, let's see, Path of the Immortal talk to Herida, Herida. Okay, so let's go talk with this chick. She's got a the typical exclamation mark. I take it you had a pleasant trip. I am Herida. I will help you settle into your new life. You are among the chosen. Eli, the great guardian god, managed to share part of his life essence with us before his departure into realms of oh, the I wonder if I saw the classes. will pass on to Aeon's most worthy daughters and sons for as long as our bloodlines endure. Immortality is bestowed on you to protect our world. 
destined to wield immense might and great authority. Perhaps one day you will be the one to take Eli's place. Hmm. Interesting. Remember to use your new powers wisely and with kindness. But to do that, you must first learn to control them. I know that might be helpful. can help you with that. Can't wait to meet him. To Flavius. He is no ordinary god. His vocation is science, but don't let that discourage you. He is a miracle worker in his own way. He is waiting for you. Now go. All right. Path of the Immortal. Go to the research center. This is neat. Look, they're like a um, typical gods, but like it's all techy. I really like this. This is a mix of kind of two worlds. I wonder why it isn't me. Uh -huh. Do you want to be immortal? Don't you? Really? Just think of it. You get to live forever and enjoy all the privileges it comes with. Don't tell me everyone is equal. You know it isn't true. To bask in glory and have your own order with thousands of followers all over the world. Oh, so we got some uh, well, upper class, class middle class, 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 lower class you stuff going on. Invasions and monsters that you'd have to fight. No, battles are not for me. I'd be like Tais. They say she has never held a weapon in her hands. She needs people to believe that to maintain her image. You think all those benefits are free? You need to earn them first with blood and sweat. Uh uh. But Tais. Oh, they're talking a bit too much, sorry. Uh, what are these? Interesting. Alright, so it looks like we're headed into... Oh, wow, look at that there. You know. That might be a good business opportunity, by the way. You only think of money. <laughs> Not gonna happen. I've got somewhere that the train. That's neat. Uh, it looks like the NPCs all kind of talk. A rookie. Hello. Liking immortality? Oh, Not you're nice to Apollo. Oh, my manners. I'm Flavius. I'm trying to advance science here while others are waving their swords. <laughs> are you joking? Of course I'm serious. Aside from me, no one's even trying to understand how things work in this world. Flavius, where are you? Oh, uh, right. This is my holographic form. No time to flit about. And there's so many immortals nowadays. Just so much to do. Right, back to business. What about the training? Where and what are we waiting for? That transport capsule? You're getting in. I'll join you in the training hall. Okay, so it looks like we're gonna go here. Oh, that's pretty cool. To the training hall. Okay, so we have a dash, we have a lock on ability, a square and a triangle. Let's say now we have some things down there. L2, which is the uh, bar is down on the right hand side. Oh wow, are these all the. Wow! What do we have? It's like a, a maid, oh, a warlock, okay. Do we have the necromancer? The monk? Alchemist, ooh. That seems interesting. Berserker. Paladin. Cryomancer, your typical maid's got the disc and everything. Pull that back out. So that's his weapon, okay. Then we have the Lightbringer, which I'm guessing is like a priest. A gunner. Oh, wow. A knight. Uh, kind of boring one gonna be on. I never really liked the knights and things. Kinetic. Hmm. Probably fight with like, um, power, like, telekinetic powers. His fists are pretty big, so he probably puts power through those. An archer, okay. And a slayer. Alright, wow, look at this. This is a beautiful game, I must say. The hole's completely virtual. 
I've been doing all of our training here, ever since my lab was nearly destroyed. What's next? First you'll need to pick a class. I'll show you how. Pick an available class, and you'll learn its basic abilities. How about that for a miracle of science? <laughs> can I change it later? Of course. You can always change your class. At oh, any time. okay. So that's right. Thank you, Flavius. In a tricky situation, you have the Argus system to offer you advice. And of course, I invented it. <laughs> I like this guy. So, let's do your highlighter. So we get to pick between the Paladin, who looks like a typical tanker, tank DPS or something, a uh, Chiromancer, who's like your range mage DPS, and then you have your Lightbringer, who's like your healer. Oh, that's cool looking. Lightbringer. I've always liked the um, the healing kind of class or support class. Um, let's go ahead with Lightbringer. Binder, actually, not Bringer. The Light Binder attacks from a distance, inflicts less damage than the Cryomancer, but has a higher survivability. This basic support class is important in any group. Their powers are aimed at protecting their teammates. Okay. Do we have abilities here? Let's look at the uh, Cryomancer. The Cryomancer can cause significant damage from a distance. However, they do not last long in close combat, so they try to avoid it. Their role in a group is to inflict damage. Even new players will have no difficulty playing this class. Hmm. So... Oh, I didn't want to select it. Dang it. <laughs> you know, I was planning on probably picking this one, but... Let's go ahead and just see then. Aren't you Shattered Storm? Oh, Nito. What you see now is a pack. These enemies are weak on the rock. Their paper loads can be extremely dangerous. Eliminate them. You use an area of effective ability. AOE ability, nice. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is neat. Enemies that are strong, but few of them should be killed one by one. Use a gun with a Nice missile. I can shoot that pretty far and fast too. I like the little outfit, that's pretty neat. <laughs> oh. Take a closer look at the enemy. Some attacks take time to execute. You give them Okay. Ah. Nito. Oh yeah, we're gonna be the uh cryomancer. <laughs> oh wow! You can even got a finisher. All right. So looks like we need to. Oh, it even tells me what I gotta do. Yeah, we. I'm gonna do a long distance. Oh, single target. Something must have broken. Oh, I thought that was uh, the game freaking out. Okay. Oh, this is cool. It's acting of RPG, definitely. I don't know what just happened there, but we pulled out this. It's like some kind of super to kind of help us out a bit. Oh, that was our L2. Okay. Divine form. Oh my gosh. That seemed like a bit much. I'm 
for that you get an achievement for that you get test dummy. Change class. You can always change your classes to any of the available classes. To change your class, press the options button. Select the class icon in the top panel of the menu. Ah, uh, okay. Equipment pad. Ah. Uh. So. Well, to be honest, I played this on PC, so I know what the light binders are a bit like. I don't know about the Paladin, so we're going to stick with the Chiromancer. Complete training session in the training hall. I think that's it. So let's go talk with uh, Flavius. Did you like it? I don't normally hand out Divine Form. It's not even in this training course, but that was an emergency. I'd say so. Someday, you'll be able to use it without my assistance. In the real world... And not just a virtual space. What do I need to do? Oh, it's nothing. Do your best. And the desired results will follow suit. There are many troubles on Alien, and the most crucial one is invasions. Go fight. Go save lives. Go make friends and gain more followers, and you will eventually become strong enough to take the next step and become a junior god. I am beginning to sound like Karita. That's it for now. You can return to the Divine Observatory, or wherever you need to go. You can stay if you like, but I can't promise any more fun. <laughs> He's just like Apollo, or like, you know, the trickster god. Okay, so we got some weapons there. Uh, select equipment. Okay, so, equipment. Each class has its own weapons that drop when you play this class. The rest of the equipment is shared and not tied to a class, okay. So, what is that going to do? <laughs> Main hand weapon, here we go. Artifact. Oh, that's what all that is. Gems of power. Okay, do we have jewelry and such? I'm pretty sure. Oh, you can have different artifacts, it looks like. Artifact 2. I wonder if the Carbo Master is just ice um, abilities. Uh, okay, so I filled all that up. I'm not quite sure exactly what that did. Quick access panel. What is that? Bag. Here we go. We received an award. Three day premium subscription. Oh! Oh, okay. This is what I downloaded before. Now it's free. You get three days of premium subscription and a normal armor. So let's press start equipment. Um, but how exactly do I put that one bag? So I'm guessing that's for the paladin, that's for the chromomancer or the light binder. Okay, reward for logging in. 
Oh, that's cool. They have a lot of reward. Okay. Get more and more and more as we go. Pyro or Chiromancer, Chiromancer. Looks like some kind of shooter type. That's obviously the class icons. Uh, I don't see too many light bringers. That's a light bringer. Binder, sorry. It's funny, my, uh, one of my priest names in World of Warcraft back on the day was uh, Lightbender. Excellent choice. Each combat school is more than just a set of skills. It is a special path, a philosophy. What's next? It is time for you to learn about the mission of Aelion's gods. Come closer to the model of the planet. Come closer. Finish. Okay. Listen. Do you hear that? Millions of voices are calling to us for help, begging us to save them. Here in the observatory, the prayers reach our ears. We are gods, but not only. But it is in our power to save lives, eliminate threats, and offer hope. Go. Alien is waiting for you. I like how they combine. It feels a little bit odd, but it's, it comes together pretty well. Okay, press the pad and you can. Uh, also, access by options, select the provinces tab. Okay, so we'll go ahead and hit this. There are nine provinces in Aelion. Each province has a separate tab on a map. Province tabs display. All available adventures. Oh wow. So apparently there's just like a ton of adventures to do. Neat. Okay, so. Oh, we get some rewards here. Premium gets a bit more. 200% more. Oh, so that's the, uh, the perk you get if you're premium. Conditional rewards. So it looks like we're gonna beat it in 15 minutes. Or is that seconds? I believe that's minutes. I'm excited. First mission, let's go. Alright, think think it Iceland Island. Continue. Alright, oh, the map to your current position. Check the map whenever needed. I started to access the map. Okay. Cool. But this one seems pretty small so far. Let's so we just have this here for the first little area. So let's see what we got. A scout. Uh, extinguish the ritual torches, eliminate the birds. First combat mission. Okay. Wow, that was quick. They don't waste time in Aelinar. Let me bring you up to speed. The Vergs built a lair here, and not just the Vergs. I spotted at least a dozen Carrions, too. That sounds bad. It looks like they attacked the neighboring town okay, from here. Okay, it looks like a pimp. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if there are also Reapers or... Ravagers with their pets. I see. What do I need to do? We need to clean up the area. Your main okay. objective is to move deeper into the island and eliminate the Carrion leader. Without a commander, they will scamper back to their burrows. We'll deal with the rest as we go. Alright, so looks like we're looking for the leader. Sorry, I'm 
trying to uh, just try to stop your habits into any of this. Okay. <coughs> So I guess I can't put it uh, away from the controller, so we might miss a little bit of the uh, transmissions that come through. I'm gonna go ahead and just wipe out some of these here. What do we have? Extinguish. <laughs> just kick it. <laughs> Alrighty. Oh, the finisher, that's right. Oh, that's what the loot looks like. Okay, knowledge of enemies. I wonder what that is. one shot at them. That was neat. This is interesting. I like this. Especially for it to be on a PS4. It's got a nice flow to it. Um, oh, we don't need that. <laughs> a nice flow and it feels like a um, fluid. Not too many buttons going on. Seems kind of simple. So 
a square and then some extra damage from the shield up because I can't die. Alright. Oh! Let's go, bruh. Square. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a fun game. I recommend this to anybody. That was fun. Oh my gosh. Now it's just like the first fight. <laughs> Press down to receive reward. Oh, that finished the adventure. Okay. We did that in eight minutes, so we met the requirement. And since we're premium, we got double. Yeah, that looks 
this a lot better actually. Kinda goes with it. Thank you everybody for watching, this has been Skyforge, once again this is Tarsizia, thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed, bye!